A lot of characters have come and gone over the seven seasons of Chicago Fire, and for every character that leaves, there's an empty space for someone new to fill. One of the biggest characters to be written out of the show was paramedic Shay, who was killed way back in the second season finale. Kara Kilmer was cast to play Shay's replacement, Sylvie Brett, in season three. Now that Kilmer is in her fifth season as part of the Chicago Fire family, she shared how it felt to replace such a beloved character like Shay. Before I get into it all, give that subscribe button a click to stay up to date with all the important TV stuff. Back to Kara Kilmer. She told Cinema Blend, Fortunately for me, no one in the cast ever made me feel like I was an outsider or that there were even shoes to fill. She's got her own set of shoes, and I'm like, I can't fill those, I'll just bring my own set of shoes. We're very different. They're really different characters. And so I think just based on how I was so welcomed by everyone, it was a great experience. I feel like the transition was really smooth, and obviously I've had four different partners on the Ambo, and now I have Annie Alonza, and she's incredible. She just jumped right in. Shay was a very beloved character, and the fact that she was killed means that viewers had to mourn that she would never come back again, except for some flashbacks. Between the popularity of her character, her face coming back up in those flashbacks, and Lauren German's place in the cast from way back in the pilot, joining the Chicago Fire cast could have been a very tricky position for Kara Kilmer. But it sounds like the rest of the cast made her feel very welcome when she stepped into play Shay's replacement. And like she said, it probably helped that Brett wasn't just a Shay 2.0. And she didn't try to be. Now Kilmer is one of the veteran cast members who is welcoming newcomers into the cast. And Brett in season 7 has been attached to newcomers Chaplain Kyle and paramedic Emily Foster. Just like Brett replaced a major character with Shay, Foster was replacing Gabriella Dawson. The show said goodbye to Dawson after actress Monica Raymond moved on from the show and she hasn't appeared since, aside from a very quick cameo at the end of the season 7 premiere. But in this case, the departing character wasn't killed off like Shay. Fortunately, Foster is very different from Dawson, just like Brett is very different from Shay so fans don't have to compare and pick a favorite, which has got to make it easier on the actresses as well. Brett didn't immediately warm up to Foster, but now the two are friends, and honestly their friendship with Stella in the mix has been one of the highlights of the season. Kilmer went on in her chat with Cinema Blend and other outlets at a recent NBC press junket. It's such a loving, like a sickeningly sweet group of people to be in. There's 12 of us, it's a big group, and nobody's a diva. Everybody has a good sense of humor, which you have to have when you're freezing your butt off. You gotta laugh. We're really fortunate. There's nothing like filming outdoors in a Chicago winter to really bring a group of people together. All things considered, it sounds like Chicago Fire is welcoming to all newcomers. We'll have to watch and see if any more replacements will be needing to join the cast anytime soon. The good news is Chicago Fire has been renewed for the 2019-2020 TV season, and you can watch new episodes every Wednesday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. Also, give that subscribe button a click if you wish Dossie was still a thing. They were great.